Caden Live is not only a video editor, but it also could be used as a screen recorder or an audio recorder. Well, I just found a very neat thing out that I can actually use my Caden Live as a screen recorder. You go up here to monitor, and at this point right here, it says show record control. When you click that, you get this little red button. When you click the little red button, you start recording. The one problem I did have with it was getting the sound to record at the same time. And I went looking on internet and I found this spot right here. Uh, Mr. Dabruda and he explained how to get sound into it where you could record the sound at the same time. And it took him some time to do it. Then as I go down through and I look, I see a couple other people have ideas. This one here, I tried this one here, and this works fine for me also. Uh, actually, they both work, but one of them has a bit of a delay at the end. So if I stop the video, if I speak and I stop it, it uh, this level will miss my last few seconds, my last second, or my last half second, I should say. So... Um, I just don't do that. But now I can record the screen. When you look at it under screen grab, it's right here, I'm using, I'm using screen grab, I've got Linux. If I look here, I'm actually recording only 1280 by 720 from the top of my, my top left down to the bottom, not my full screen. My full screen gets all my menus and everything at the bottom because I'm running Linux. So I'm only capturing the one area here. So I can, uh, it's really pretty neat. It's really pretty neat. Um, and I'm capturing all my sound and everything. When you set up your sound in it, what I had to do is go to set up my sound. And I set it up with also right here. And this works for me. This is what I put inside. But this one works also. If I use Pulse, it works too. So they both seem to work with no problem. And that allows me to get the sound with it. This is really a pretty neat thing for me because I do a lot of capturing with FFmpeg and converting and now that's over. I don't need to do that. I can use my Kden Live, drop it right straight into my program because when I stop this, I'm going to stop it and start it back up. And then I'll tie these two videos together. Now I just clicked it and started it back up. And what you see is when I stopped it the first time, here's my video. Right there. And that's my first video. And I'm recording this right now. And I don't know. I wonder if I could play this. That'd be pretty neat. Yes, I can hear the sound and everything myself. But I think the recorder won't get that sound. I think it will get only my microphone. But I don't know. We're going to go back. And this is a movie right now. This is enough to explain basically how give it one second before you stop the video hey if you enjoy this video like subscribe and click on a link above thank you